Hey, what's up everyone? Saints fan back again with another GTA 5 video and today in a shocking turn of events Rockstar actually did not release one of the new aircrafts So I thought we were gonna be hitting the bomb shuka and many other people did Because that was the first aircraft that is on the war stock cash and carry website and it usually follows that pattern But I guess what Rockstar wanted to do instead was release one of the new cars because today we actually received the Rapid GT Classic, which I am actually not complaining about because this car is amazing. It may cost a little bit, you know, more than it's worth, but just my first impressions alone, this thing is great and it's worth the money. I mean, it has a ton of customization and it feels good driving. I'll be doing a separate review on it later today to let you guys know if you actually should buy it or not, but so far I'm really, really liking it. Now, one thing that uh, Rockstar actually did listen to us was with the payouts on the hangar missions. So in my Rockstar Logic like two weeks ago or a week and a half ago, I basically pleaded with Rockstar, I was like, look, at least make these missions twice as much as we're getting now. While that may still not be great, that's way better than it is now. And it looks like they actually listened because the first double event week that we're getting is double hangar missions. So I'm hoping this lasts for more than a week. I'm hoping it even lasts more than two weeks. I'm hoping it lasts for like the entire month. So Rockstar can just say, look, we're sorry. Bam, here's double smuggler run missions for a month. Have fun because the missions are super fun. Flying around and doing all the cool stuff, you know, that's really fun, but it was just the payouts that kind of were unfortunate. So now that it's two times the amount, I think everyone's gonna be a lot more happy. But again, people would be even more happy if they let this go on for a month. I don't think that's gonna happen, but man, would that not be awesome? Actually, I guess I didn't read this in the newswire, but it says that the double GTA money and RP4 cargo and smugglers run cell missions is only going through September 18th. So it looks like we're actually only gonna be getting them for a week, but I don't know, that's uh, it's look, it's good for right now, but it's gonna suck obviously once that does go away. But I would highly recommend getting your sourcing missions in now while you can get a decent amount of money. So in addition to all that, there's double GTA money and RP continuing in the Motor Wars adversary mode. So if you guys have been playing that a lot, you've been liking it, then double money and it is gonna continue for the next week. And if you wanna get back into stunt racing, then all Rockstar created stunt races will be paying twice the amount as well. So you have some pretty fun ways to make double money this week in GTA Online. In addition to all that though, bodyguards and associates will be receiving double GTA money salaries. So I guess it's kind of good. As for the discounts, you will receive 25% off of all countermeasures. So if you haven't put countermeasures on your aircraft yet, now is definitely the time to do it. And if you want to upgrade the aircraft engine and armor, that's also 25% off. As for some vehicles, we actually have some really, really solid vehicles with a 25% off discount. So the Trafade Nero and the Pegasi Tempesta, two of the best supercars in the game and two of the best looking supercars in the game with the 25% off discount. It's not a whole lot of money, but that's the cheapest you probably are going to get it. So if you've been looking at maybe purchasing a Nero or a Nero Custom or the Tempesta, do it now. And then the other discount is 25% off engine and armor upgrades for all cars. So you'll get some discount if you're upgrading vehicles. Now as always, there's a premium race and time trial. Doesn't really matter. I don't know anyone who does those anymore, but there are new ones. There you guys have it though. That is the event week for this week. I'm guessing maybe next week we'll get the Bomb Shuka. I know the Bomb Shuka is going to be the first plane. I guess we just don't know if they're going to release one of the other cars before it. Anyway, thank you all for watching. Like I said, I'll be doing another video or two later today talking about the Rapid GT Classic, if it's good, if it's not good, and then maybe even doing a paint job guide if it does end up being worth your money. So thank you all. Please look forward to those. I'll be doing a shark card giveaway actually on my Twitter, so go follow me. I'll announce that later on today. So if you want some free cash or if you want a chance to win some free cash, go Go follow me over there. But thank you all. As always, I'll see you guys in the next one.